<clears throat> off the top of my head, one of the most important skills that I'm eager to learn in the future can definitely how to effectively resolve disagreements. I mean, there's no exaggeration to say that conflicts is an inevitable part of our life. It can even arise from many aspects of life, whether it can be a personal or even professional relationships. Well, in my opinion, instead of letting it, instead of letting an argument escalate into a fight, or even worse, I mean, try to learn more how to handle them with finesse and tact can definitely a good idea. I mean, speak from my, my experience, there's a few benefits can definitely generate it from learning these specific skills. Well, first of all, or even for the most part, conflict can definitely save relationships. You know, by learning how to listen to the opposing viewpoints or acknowledge all the differences, I maybe have a better relationship with my dad since most of the time I usually have an intense arguments with my dad, especially about a career or my career orientation and also what kind of job or occupation I really want to do in the future. So if I had had learned this skill before, my relationship with my dad would have been much better. On a second, secondly, I mean, you know, trying to learn more about conflict resolution skills can, you know, improve your productivity and also your effectiveness in the workplace. I mean, become a worker is not a good thing, especially in Vietnam, which is quite demanding. And you have to make sure that how valuable you are to your company on a regular basis. And that's the only reason might lead to an argument in the workplace or even in your working environment. And that's not a good thing at all. So when, whenever the managers feel hurt or valued, or you know, they try or they understand the contribution of the employee, that's why or that's the good way to improve your productivity and to make you to work more cohesively. And the final things, it you know, trying to solve a disagreement can even improve your emotional intelligence. And somehow it can even broaden your horizon because in order to solve an argument, you have to understand the opposition of um, the other person's perspective and I, you have to be conservative enough to stand your ground and try not to getting offensive. And I mean, I'll try my best to attend to some workshops or even try to accumulate knowledge, especially as some practical classes if I had a chance. Because for now, I mean, since because of my hectic schedule was all the works and study, so I don't think I have enough time for it. But I hopefully I can have it in the future. So thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much.